Okay, we're going to try this. Bonjour, bonjour. <laughs> I'm trying again. Facebook has totally changed things on me and it's getting, it's hard today to, uh, to live stream. Could you tell me if the picture is horizontal, if it's fine for you? I don't see any comments, but if you could tell me if uh, the picture is horizontal, that would be very helpful. I know there's a delay in the comments, so I'm not really worried. It's vertical again. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna keep it vertical because they've just <laughs> this is Facebook for you. They've changed things around on me and I cannot make it work. So I'll have to figure it out before the next live stroll. Right now, I just did it once already, but it didn't reach you. So I have to redo the stroll I just did. So this is a fun day in live streaming world. Um, but I want to welcome you in the beautiful city of Blois. We are looking at the uh, magnificent cathedral called Saint Louis Cathedral. And right here is the city hall, this beautiful building. And I want to show you something that used to belong to be attached to this building. This building, um, as early as the 17th century, belonged to the Catholic Church. It was actually the diocese uh, main building and uh, the bishops of Blois lived here. And eventually, as you know, during the French Revolution, they lost a lot of their properties. And so, um, you know, eventually it became more of a public building. Today, it's the city hall. It's been a museum at times as well. And I'm going to share with you something that used to belong to it. But first, this beautiful row of trees, the marronnier chestnut trees. And uh, they were planted just 10 years ago to replace uh, ancient, ancient trees that were here, right here on this Belvedere. And from here, you have an absolutely magnificent view. And I so wish I could film <laughs> horizontally, but this will have to do for now. I will try and fix this for, for the next stroll, my apologies. But this is the view we have from up here, the beautiful city of Blois, overlooking the Loire River, like so many cities in the Loire Valley. You see the beautiful um, slate rooftops as well. And so where I am taking you, my little friends, is down there. The bishops of Blois used to own this property and 20 years ago, the city turned this piece of land that used to be part of the gardens of the church into a rose garden. And this is the perfect time of year to see it. So we are going to go down there. You will not be able to smell the roses, unfortunately, <laughs> so to speak. But uh, hopefully the colors will make up for that. So welcome to the city of Blois, where I am spending the day. This morning, I live streamed on Instagram to show our viewers a really fun local museum, the Museum of Magic. So if you want to see that later, you can. And right now we are sitting on one of the highest points in the city. And the city takes a lot of climbing to explore. So some people never come to the Rose Garden because they don't know it's here or they don't want to climb all the way up here. So we are going to go down there and look at these beautiful flowers. And this uh, horse, this person on the horse over there, you know her. This is Joan of Arc. She's made her mark on this whole region. She met the king in Chinon got suited with an armor and met her troops in Tours, where I live. And all, the, all around the Loire, all around the Touraine region, there are 
statues, signs remembering Jeanne d'Arc, Joan of Arc. Now, interestingly, the statue was a gift to the city of Tours in France in the 1920s from uh, the United States, from a gentleman. His name is right here and I'm going to show it to you. Cette statue fut offerte à la France et à la ville de Blois par un citoyen américain, J. Sanford Saltus. So his name was J. Sanford Saltus and he donated the statue to the city of Blois and France. How generous. It's a beautiful one. And she does look like a warrior on this horse right there. And she's looking straight at the beautiful cathedral we just saw and the former bishop's palace, which is now the city hall of Blois. From this side, you also have magnificent views. That other church you see in the background over there is uh, St. Nicholas Church, also a beautiful church. And look at the rose garden. So about 20 years old, a very popular place in town for people to wander it's in the heart of the old town and all around here you have benches and trees that provide shade in the summer where people can come and sit. So we are going to go down now and we will visit the Rose Garden. If you've just joined us, welcome. This is Vero and I am taking you for a stroll or on a stroll in the city of Blois in the Rose Garden of the city of Blois. If you come here, don't do what I did. Check the schedule first. It opens at certain times of the week. And um, I wanted to live stream early today for my Australian friends and Kiwi friends, but it didn't open until 2 p.m. So I had to, I went and had lunch and came back. So when I'm down those stairs, we will be able to explore the Rose Garden. Merci. Merci beaucoup. Oops. Sorry there. Not a good tech day, you might say. So as you explore the garden, you have the rose garden, you have different sections and they've created patterns with all these roses and different colors and the scent. Oh, I wish you could smell this. Step here and see. Nice shaded area. In case you're wondering where I'm filming vertically, it's not on purpose. Facebook has been fighting me for the last hour. Facebook and I have our moments. I did not win today. Facebook did. But at least you get to enjoy the sights, if not the smell of these roses. If you are leaving comments, I apologize, but they're not showing. I only saw a couple at the beginning and now the screen is perfectly silent. Like I was saying, a challenging tech day. We have those. Quite a few of you have found me, which is wonderful. I know it's still early and some parts of the world are 
pretty late already, as it turns out. Thank you for being here. Oh, look at the white ones. Some buds on this one. Let's see. What do we have here? More roses and the beautiful views behind them overlooking the Loire. Oh, the size of these roses. This is my hand. Look at the size of this rose. And these tiny little climbing ones. Perfection. So picture the bishop and all the people who used to be part of the Catholic orders here in this town, 17th through 18th century, and after that, the revolution and they eventually lost the gardens. The city took over and created this magnificent place about 10, 20 years ago, I think. Not bad. And now the public, of course, gets to enjoy them. I think I should go this way. So it is my plan to um, take you on another stroll around the famous Chateau de Blois, one of the big royal palaces in France. Very interesting one. So I will uh, probably pop in again around 4 p.m. France time. The Loire is right behind those rooftops. If you've missed the beginning of the stream, you can go back and watch it later. And then until four o'clock, I'm going to try and figure out what's happening with Mr. Facebook here. He's been misbehaving today and I'm not happy with him or her or whatever it is. So we are looking at the city hall, which a long time ago was part of the diocese where the bishop lived. You might say the French church lived very well, at least some people in the French church. Oh. So again, you can catch a uh, quick visit at the local Museum of Magic. There is a story behind that. That's why I'm telling you to check it out. It's on Instagram. And uh, it's a five minute live stream or so. This one will be available hopefully as soon as I come off the air, though it is a vertical. <laughs> Not a bad door. What do you think? And when you come out, you are in the heart of Blois' old town, medieval part of town. Up high, pretty up high, this is the site of the cathedral. And I missed a step. <laughs> the 
Look at that. So this is where I'm going to head now. I'm going to uh, walk downhill, head back to the other side of town. I'll be looking into this Facebook situation. If I cannot fix it, what I might do is share a YouTube link and then we will meet on YouTube later because the relationship may be irretrievably broken now. Anyway, thank you for joining me for this stroll in the beautiful Roseray Rose Garden in Blois. And I will see you around 4 p.m. France time. A bientôt les amis.